So you don't know which OtterBox case to get for your iPhone 15 Pro Max? A lot of changes have come to the OtterBox line, especially since Apple started carrying two of their cases inside of their stores, which is gonna be on the Lumen and the Fagura, those two. But the other five are synonymous with what OtterBox is well known for, great protection, good grip, and heavier weight. Ever since Apple started picking them up, they have been really focused on coming out with designs that might be more catchy, similar to what you would see on something like a Casetify case. So let's take a closer look at each of these cases and then test out their MagSafe. Because one thing that OtterBox is not advertising as much as some of the other companies is their MagSafe capabilities. So we have, this is going to be on the Lumen case and this is going to be in the pink colorway. The buttons are relatively clicky, but they're not gonna protrude so much. And I think that's actually related to what Apple likes more than what OtterBox likes. Because if you look at the Apple clear case, the OtterBox Lumen is gonna have just about the same thickness of buttons. It's a very grippy material as you can see. So I'm just holding it by two fingers and it is still sticking to my hand. Now we can also show you what it looks like in the black colorway. Pretty good. It's not going to be the most grippy, but it's definitely not going to be very slippery. And it is very light weight. So this case weighs a total of 37 grams. So we have 37 grams listed there. Now that we have our Lumen case, let me put it on and show you how strong the MagSafe is. So we have our Apple MagSafe. It's not going to be as strong of a magnet as some of the newer cases from some of the other manufacturers. This is for sure. You can see how easily I can pop this in and out. So not as strong. You can also see how easily it is to move it around. So this is an ESR case with the upgraded MagSafe magnets that are so popular now. You can see how much more strong the magnet is relative to the other. Definitely stronger on these newer cases. So this is the other OtterBox case Apple has on their store. This is the Fagora case. We're going to put it on our blue titanium iPhone 15 Pro Max. And you can see how it looks. So I really do like the design here. It is really nice inside of the hand and some of them have this more decorative design. It has a more protruding and secondary color like a color block for the camera bump. The buttons are also pretty shallow and that is really in line with the Apple clear case. Still overall, good looking case. It's gonna be opaque, but biggest drawback will be slipperiness. So Figura also has the least amount of drop protection. It is really the only OtterBox we've ever seen that is just one drop. Not even three drops, five drops, two drops, just one drop here. So again, I wouldn't say this is the most sticky. You can see how easily it pops off. And I, I think that's just related to the magnet they chose. And if I compare the Fagura case to the ESR case as our baseline, you can see that these new cases, the magnet is much stronger. In terms of overall weight, the Fagura case weighs 38 grams, so just the same as the Lumen. So next up will be on the OtterBox Symmetry case. This is definitely OtterBox's most popular case and is their clear case. And they've invested a lot of thought into this particular version. Now, what I'm most curious is how powerful is the MagSafe magnet? Because I already know that this case gives a lot of protection. And that's because of its size and weight. So relative to some of the other clear cases on the market, you'll notice that the OtterBox has a tighter fit. So definitely a tighter fit. You'll notice that the bumpers as well as the corners are going to be bigger, so they're thicker. There's no air cushion here that's going to be sticking out, but you can definitely see they are thicker. Now, the funny thing about these tactile buttons is that they're kind of recessed, so it's hard to feel which one is which. You can definitely feel which one is the action button, but the next two are going to feel kind of blended in. Same thing on the sides. I think the material looks very good. This is coming with a polycarbonate and synthetic rubber hybrid case design. So that means on the sides, it's gonna be that synthetic rubber, which means it's more grippy. And on the back, it is polycarbonate. In terms of drops, you can drop this from up to 3X military grade. It does have reinforced corners that you can see here. You can see the space between your phone and the corners. And that is what gives it the ultimate drop protection. So this has been updated. And you can see how much protection it gives. And you can also see that on the front. And that's something I like. Now, in terms of the buttons, I wouldn't say that the buttons are much better this time around. In my opinion, the buttons 
are actually going to be harder to find even though they're gentle. They're like kind of like a silent press button. In terms of overall size, this is going to be 6.54 by 3.33 by 0 0.57. You can see how much thicker the bumpers are on the Symmetry than on the Lumen. So definitely heavier weight, more protection on the Symmetry over the Lumen here. As you can see, it is a very grippy case. I'm moving it around on just my fingers. And I would not be worried about drop protection here because of the thickness of the bumpers. However, the Symmetry series weighs 45 grams, so this is going to be considerably more heavy than most of the clear cases you're going to find, especially in that $30 to $40 range. Autobox Symmetry is coming in at 42 grams here. And the MagSafe is slightly metallic there. So we're going to show you how strong is the magnet. So still pretty mild in terms of the stickiness or the strength of the magnet, even on the Symmetry. And before you guys jump out at me and say, well, why are you only showing the ESR? Maybe just the ESR has a better magnet. This is a Spigen Ultra Hybrid. So this case would cost about $19. And this is the Spigen Ultra Hybrid. You can also see that the MagSafe is much stronger on these newer cases. So still, even on the Spigen, it is stronger than the OtterBox. Next up will be the OtterBox Commuter Series. So on the Commuter Series, this is what it looks like. It's going to be a two-piece case. And that two-piece means you can open it, you can separate it between the rubber inner shell and the polycarbonate top shell. You want to pop that in, pop it in, pop it in, pop it in. And this is going to be the Commuter Series. Now, obviously, you won't be able to tell what color or really see what color your iPhone 15 Pro Max is. If you're wondering, is the commuter case going to be as grippy as the Symmetry case? No, the Symmetry case is going to be stickier on the back, much better in terms of overall grip, because as you can see, this will just slide right out of your hand. So but overall, it does give solid drop protection. It is a nice looking case and they come in multiple colorways. They've changed the camera bump design here, as you can see. But overall, not a huge change. The buttons are okay clicky. No, I wish they were clickier. You can't hear them click. So that is going to be silent. It's really like a silent button pressing here. It has a MagSafe built in, but there's no MagSafe circle that you can see. So let's see how strong that MagSafe magnet is. So not that strong. I think that's because there is a big piece of polycarbonate in between, but not that strong. You can pop it off. I mean, just slide it right off. And if we check the weight of our, this weighs 59 grams. This is the Symmetry Soft Grip and it's made out of silicone, except it's gonna be more durable. So the Soft Grip comes in at 47 grams. The MagSafe is pretty standard here, nothing special there. The material is gonna be silicone, so it is quite squishy, but also a little bit rigid, right? This is not gonna be the squishy, squishy, squishy silicone that we are used to. This has a, a bit of rigidity in it. And let's put in our iPhone. So the secret of it is that it's an updated material, so it's nice and velvety feel in the hand. And I've not seen a case like this before because the silicon cases are generally lighter. This still comes with 3X military grade drop protection. The measurements are gonna be 6.53 by 3.33 by 0 0.56 inches. There are two areas where you can attach a lanyard. So they have lanyard areas here that you can attach a lanyard to it. And this has that built-in rigidity. I can drop it and it still has 3X military grade. In terms of overall grip, it will not be as grippy as the polycarbonate cases for sure. So you can see how slippery it will come out of your hand. And that's in comparison because you want that velvety soft feel, but you sacrifice some of the grip to get it. See how this compares to a clear symmetry series. You can see them side by side, from side by side. You can also see the buttons and the sides. So not a huge difference overall in the size, shape, or weight. It just really comes down to different material and overall grippiness is better on the clear case, but the updated soft touch is gonna be definitely soft to touch. We also wanna see how strong the MagSafe is here. So, so sticks, but still pretty weak. Let's see if I can just pull it. Let's see if I can just drop it off. So definitely still pretty weak there. Just as an example from the ESR, it doesn't just pop out like 
you can't really push it off. So much stronger magnets on the newer cases here. So the Defender XT, they're finally making this lighter and lighter. And that's because instead of having this big front cover piece, they have reduced that to just this. But by reducing it to something so small, it makes installing it much more difficult. So on the Defender Series XT, this is coming with that polycarbonate shell and the synthetic rubber sides. And that means it's gonna be very grippy. The back is also very grippy. So it comes with the same sticky grep back that you would get inside of the Symmetry Series. The buttons are pretty clicky on your Defender XT. So, and there's an area for your lanyard. So overall, just a new iteration of a tried and true design. It is very protective. And this is really what OtterBox is known for, a very protective case. Gonna be on the Defender XT. Defender XT come weighing in at 54 grams. And let's also check how strong the magnet is. On the magnet, but still, again, not that strong in terms of the strength, but still, right? Not that strong. So the magnet is not as strong, like you could just take it off easily. So this is gonna be on the Otter Grip. You can just take out the fingers so you can move it around easily. So on the Otter Grip, it does come with MagSafe. So it will fit. It is just as strong as all the other OtterBox cases. This is a hard plastic here, so I would worry about dropping this on cement just because you'll notice the scratches. So if you're taking a closer look at this case, this is gonna be a soft, so that's where they, a lot of the synthetic rubber comes in. The synthetic rubber is also gonna be on the bumpers here, so it's gonna be more squishy. As you can see, I'm opening it up. But the back is gonna be in that polycarbonate shell. Now, this is gonna have 3X military grade protection. Can also rotate it so very easy to use because your finger is going to be com going completely inside we'll see how durable this is because the question is how much force this can this withstand it feels like it can stand a good amount but if i yank this pretty hard i feel like i can break the case and an overall drop protection here pretty good but still pretty slippery it's gonna fall right out of your hand so you just got your iPhone 15 Pro Max and you don't know which OtterBox case to get. So basically you get a lot of protection as well as some new innovations from OtterBox with the rubber sides, with features that we're always looking for on our cases, but you're gonna have to pay more money and the MagSafe is going to be uh, so-so because it's really 2022 MagSafe. It is not the new 2023, 2024 MagSafe magnets. And I think OtterBox made a mistake by that because all the new accessories, including the wallets, are really built around having powerful magnets, including car mounts. So I hope OtterBox is gonna update the magnets in their MagSafe to be more powerful. But overall, if you're looking for a reliable protective case, I think their Symmetry case is one of the best clear cases you can get right now and remember i bought all of these cases myself i spent 500 dollars on otterbox cases so you won't have to because this case right here is a awesome clear case i know it's not coming with some of the bumpers you might see on the case divide cases and some of the other brands but what it does do is that it has a really clean effortless design and allows you to show off the overall looks of your iPhone 15. But I hope OtterBox is gonna focus more and more on protection because by making the cases lighter and lighter for phones that are getting more and more expensive, well, I hope they remember that the whole point of a case is to protect your phone, which is really why I look for an OtterBox when I get a phone case for my iPhone. So please, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment box below and please hit that like or subscribe button. It really does help support our channel. And I'll catch you next time. This is Dave with the French Glow, signing off. Bye, bye, bye.